calling unto the multitude of the tender mercies. Blot out my transgressions. Wash me truly from my iniquity and cleanse me from my sin. For acknowledge my transgression and my sin is ever before me. Against thee, the only have I seen and done this evil in thy sight. That thou mayest be justified when thou speakest and be clean when thou judgest. Behold, I was shaped in iniquity and in sin did my mother conceive me. Behold, thou didst truth in the inward part and in the hidden part. Thou shalt meet me to know wisdom. Cause me with his bone, and, and I shall be clean. Wash me, and I shall be whiter than snow. Make me to hear joy and gladness, that the bone which thou hast broken may rejoice. Hide thy faith from my sin, and blot out all my transgressions. Blot out, sorry, blot out all my iniquity. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. Cast me not away from the present, and take not the Holy Spirit from me. Restore unto me the joy of the salvation, and uphold me with the free spirit. Then will I take transgression the ways, and sinners shall be committed unto me. Deliver me from blood guiltiness, O God, thou God of my salvation, and my tongue shall sing aloud of the righteousness. O Lord, open down my lips, and my mouth shall show forth thy purity. For thou deserve not sacrifice, <coughs> would I give it thou diligent, not in bond offering. The sacrifice of God are a broken spirit, a broken and a conscious heart, O God, thou will not despise. Do good in thy good pleasure unto Zion, build thou the walls of Jerusalem. Then shalt thou be pleased with the sacrifice of righteousness, with bond offering and whole bond offering. They shall they offer bullock upon the altar. 51 Psalm 19 verses. Glory to the Son of the Holy Spirit. Take my life and let it be. Consecrate me now, Jose. man be born again of the Holy Spirit, he cannot see the kingdom of God. Marvel not, therefore, that I say unto you, he must be born again. Yeah. And they brought young children to Jesus, that he might touch them. And his disciples rebuked those that brought them. Jesus, seeing this, was greatly displeased, and said unto them, Suffer little children to come unto me, and forbid them not. For such is the kingdom of heaven. Yes. Truly I say unto you, whosoever shall receive the kingdom of God as a little child shall not enter therein. When mother was there, and the children to Jesus, and the He had brought this child unto the church that he may dedicate and name it among the children of the faith. Know ye therefore how grave a responsibility rests upon your soul as parents and sponsor. For this day you make a covenant with God and the church to take vows and accept responsibility for this child and his future in the church and the world. Jesus said it is better that a milestone was hung upon your neck and you will be cast into the sea rather than often offend one of these little ones. For the angels will always behold the face of God in heaven. I charge you therefore that ye make this covenant and vow truthfully before God on behalf of this child here present. Gentle Jesus, live In accepting the responsibility of this child of bringing in the faith, I must inform you that it is your duty to make a covenant with God 
and a church to teach a cause to be taught to this child the creed, the Our Father and the commandment of Jehovah and Jesus Christ. To take a cause to be brought to a Christian church, this child when he has attained an age of speech and infirmities of gifts, that it may be taught the gospel and exhort to pass its life in Christian devotion and godliness. I ask you, do you covenant and vow here in the presence of God and the church to honor these vows and this covenant, which by your assent that he consents you make today? As I say, I do. Approach my and my action, I renew today the vows of my baptism and accept the O Jesus Christ as my Savior, Mediator, and King. I most humble beg for your forgiveness for all sins which I have committed, consciously or unconsciously, hiddenly or openly, I also ask your forgiveness for all sins which I know or do not know. Accept our vows and guide us in the right path. For there is no other word to worship besides thee. Amen. I believe in God the Father Almighty, the maker of heaven and earth, and Jesus Christ, the Son of our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit. Born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, who was crucified and buried. He descended to God again from the dead. He ascended to God the Father Almighty. From then shall come to judgment and the dead. I know the God to the Christian Church. Come near us, come near us, resurrection by the last day. And in and he took them up in his arms and lay his hands upon them and bless them. See,
shall refer, keep thee in health. And defend thee from all danger approaching from the east and the element of air. Adona, my mighty archangel Michael, defend me from Satan and from all evil approaching from the sun and the element of fire. Ehi, hey, may the mighty archangel Gabriel. Be thy swift messenger and instructor and defender thee from all danger approaching from the west and the element of water. Agla, O thou who art mighty forever, may the mighty archangel Uriel defend thee from all evil approaching from the north and the element of earth. Amen. To God be the kingdom, the power, and the glory. Forever and ever. And this sign which I place upon the mind and the heart of this child do not dare to violate upon pain of the awful punishment of God. Amen. Blessed be thy air that it may open to his word, Ephetha, be thou open. Blessed be thy hands that he may forever do his work. Blessed be thy seeds and thy loins that they may hold and inherit the earth in prosperity. Receive the salt of wisdom. Yeah. And the holy of compassion. Yeah. That your speech may be blessed with the tongue of the wise. Yeah. Blessed be thy mouth, that it may forever praise the Lord.
I named him Makela Destiny Evans in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. May God bless thee with prosperity and keep thee from all evil. May he show forth his face in mercy, accept thee into his holy family, clothe thee with the robe of innocence. Write thy name in the book of life. May he provide for thee always and grant thee eternal blessings with him and his saints forever. The Lord my